Baseball action is on the air as MLB The Show comes to you from Venerable Fenway Park here in Boston on what's shaping up to be an entertaining afternoon for baseball. Up next is a rematch from the 2007 World Series as it'll be the Colorado Rockies taking on the Boston Red Sox. And hi again, everybody. Matt Van Skurgen here to bring you all the action. Joining me in the booth, Dave Campbell and Rex Hudler. Dave, let's turn to you. What leaps out at you first when you take a look at this matchup? Well, one guy that really burst onto the national stage is Jacoby Ellsbury. Here's a guy that was playing in Pawtucket his latest September 1st, yet more than a month later, he was the starting center fielder and hoisting a World Series trophy. I think his potential is as high as any young player in the game today. At the top of the lineup, Willie Tavares out in center field. After that, shortstop Troy Tulowitzki. The right-handed hitting Matt Holliday is next out in left field. Todd Helton is in the cleanup spot at first base. In the five hole is Garrett Atkins at third base. Then comes Brad Hopp. He'll be out in right. Corey Sullivan is the DH today in the number seven spot. Next is your Victorialba, the catcher. Marcus Giles will round out the order. He will play second. And they'll have a tough test in store for them for sure as they'll face off against the big league's only 20-game winner in 2007, Cy Young runner-up Josh Beckett. For as good as his regular season was, Beckett really turned it on in the postseason, going 4-0 in his four starts and allowing just four earned runs in 30 innings pitched. And a look there at the Red Sox defensively behind Beckett as they're led by a guy who played a perfect season defensively in 2007. First time Gold Glove Award winner Kevin Euclid at first base. Coming forth now is the leadoff hitter Willie Tavares and we are set to go now from Fenway Park. from the left side of the plate, he might have beaten this out, but those extra two steps cost him that time. With one away, that'll bring in the shortstop, Troy Tulowitzki. thing is a fastball. It just dips right out of the zone. Hitters hate it. And a fastball blew it right by him. There are two down. So with two gone, in steps Matt Holliday. ahead here with the fastball strike one getting ahead always a key when you're facing a guy like this two out nobody on and here's a fastball called for strike two two strikes two outs time to turn it loose now good waste pitch one and two This ball two. And I wonder now if we'll see that curveball a third time here with two strikes. He hasn't flinched yet. 2-2 two -two pitch on the way. And fastball. Ball strike three and the side is retired. 
So Beckett goes in order one, two, three at the top of the first. Now the Red Sox will get their shot, no score. And the starting lineup for those Red Sox looks like this. Leading things off is Dustin Pedroia. He'll play second base. After that is the first baseman, Kevin Euclid. And the three spot is the always dangerous David Ortiz. He's the DH. In the fourth spot, the equally dangerous Manny Ramirez in left field. Mike Lowell will bat fifth. He's at third base. J.D. Drew bats sixth and plays right. Jason Baritek hits seventh behind the plate. Batting eighth is the center fielder, Jacoby Ellsbury. And Julio Lugo will round out the lineup. He is at short. He'll go to work against the Canadian-born left-hander Jeff Francis. Francis was a huge part of the Rockies' improbable run to the NL pennant last season as he finished fourth in the league with 17 wins and really took that step from middle-of-the-rotation guy to true staff ace. And behind Francis, the Rockies' defense will line up like this. now is Dustin Pedroia as he'll lead off the home half of inning number one. second base for out number two. Manny Ramirez will be the batter. And there's the fastball by Francis as this is on the ground for Tulewitzki at short. Throw on to help and will take care of him and the inning is over. So just the one hit in the inning, but it's a home run that pushes him out in front. On to the second inning now from Fenway Park. The Red Sox on top, one to nothing. Todd Helton leads things off now in the top half of the second. And Beckett will start him out with a fastball here as he jumps ahead, nothing and one. And early on, you can see him trying to jam guys with that pitch, not let them get extended. And that misses downstairs for a ball, one and one. Oh, and I think he had him lunging that time, but he was wisely able to hold back. Now a swing and a sinking line drive out to right center. And this will be put away easily for the out. So one gone in the inning for Garrett Atkins. Fouled off into the seats behind first. 